YouTube's Farmer Son Prepping here. It's going a little hike, a little walk and talk today, me and the boys. Weather today is about, uh, I think, it's supposed to top out around 55 or something like that. We did not get a uh, freeze last night like they were talking about. But uh, it, it got cold. It is no frost yet. We'll probably get that tonight. Got to be careful walking through these hay fields. I made me a selfie stick <laughs> out of a piece of wood. <laughs> that way it's lighter. All right, boys, quit now. They can fight, they just don't need to be fighting right up next to me. That bothers me. Because I've had them knock me over before. I've already got, you know, 40 ish pounds extra on this bum leg of mine. That would not be good. How about that? Well, that thing will get on out there, won't it? I like this selfie stick. So, my plan is to walk today to where I camped last time. This is a good little distance and back, hopefully, if I don't run out of memory card or whatever. So if it runs out, it runs out, y'all. That's the plan. I figured the uh, right, round bunch of youngins. I haven't done a walk and talk in quite a while. I mean, I've I've been, you know, walking with my pack a lot, but not on camera. Uh, so I decided that's what I'd film for today. Hope you all are doing well. All right, boys. I can't exactly show you the dogs because I got the camera on this, you know, six foot piece of wood here. Maybe y'all can hear it though. I do have, uh, I don't know if I can show it or not, I do have my Glock 19 right here, in case I run into a critter or a snake. <clears throat> this is my new outside the waistband holster that I just recently got. Putting her to the test today. Snakes are uh, still out. I saw one the other day down at the creek. Big old cotton mouth. So maybe this first little cold snap will make them go underground or whatever. You have to be careful in these pastures. There's holes and stobs sometimes. And so I'm just kind of carefully watching where I'm going here. Dad's been doing some shooting today. I don't know if he's sighting his rifle in or what, probably. scoping out things on the ground too, things that uh, shine in the sun a little bit. I've actually found coins that way, like old uh, rosy dimes and that kind of stuff. Roosevelt dime, sorry, I'm speaking uh, coin nerd. Roosevelt dimes, the silver kind. Alright, now I'm entering the four-wheeler trail. 
there's an old tractor. I thought about putting that thing in my yard. Can y'all see that? Old International. Somebody brought it down here for Dad to fix. And uh, Dad took an inventory of all the parts it was going to take to fix it. The guy, I guess, couldn't afford it. He just left it and never come back for it. I thought about putting that thing in my yard and making a uh, flower garden or something around it. You know, in true redneck style. <laughs> Rustic, I guess you could call it. I did go through my camera and cleaned out a bunch of stuff. Hoping I have enough space for this entire walk. Got rid of a bunch of pictures and memes and stuff that I'd already posted. Over here behind me, I don't know if you can see all that, but we uh, we burn a lot of this stuff right before the burn bands because uh, the undergrowth was just getting bad snakes were getting bad sometimes it's good to burn off all that old undergrowth right over here too there's a road right there see if y'all can see that and then over here is burnt as well just i'm going this way basically i'm just walking four-wheeler trails today y'all before they get too muddy Cause they will get muddy once the rainy season starts. Whoa, there's a hole. Alright boys, they are having a time today. Just a running and a ripping. Cool weather. Boy, dogs sure do love it. They get all frisky. Leaves are everywhere. Should have worn my boots. I'm wearing my old wore out pin shoes that I ride forward on all the time, or in all the time. Let me swap that over to this arm. Whew. These old four wheeler trails are rough. They got roots in them, holes. Yes, I'm coming, doggy. Kind of look for uh, whoops, there's a limb there. Kind of look for uh, deer tracks and stuff too while I'm walking. Once you mess up a uh, mess up a leg, walking on unlevel ground is not the easiest thing anymore, like it used to be. I don't know why that is. I'm just so afraid I'm gonna twist my ankle or something like that. When that happens, by God, it hurts. All right, dog. Right 
So that, I don't know if I can show you all that or not. That right there kind of looks like a deer track. Hmm. Yep, because there's another one. All right, we got some deer sign going on. Sorry, y'all wouldn't pay attention to how I was holding the camera. I was holding it all sideways. Forgive me of my shoddy camera work. You know, that's something I have to say every time. Oh, those are dog prints right there. I am carrying water. Oh, please don't knock me over. Y'all make me nervous when you do that crap. One went on one side, the other one on the other. I was in the middle. Got to our junction here in the four wheeler path. Road behind me, road that way, road that way. So we're gonna go that way. Any redneck's got to have a plethora of four-wheeler trails, you know. There's a hole. something red it was a leaf there's another damn hole yeah I'll kind of give y'all a look at what what I'm walking on right here I'll do this for a minute just kind of Across the grass, I get my feet caught on holes that you can't see on kind of grass, all that kind of good stuff. Hope y'all are remembering to stack everything you can, preserve all the food you can. I've been doing that. I wanted to say congratulations to Shift Kicker on her first successful live. That was awesome. You outdid me. I ain't never had 56 people in my chat. So you're doing great, honey. I'm coming, doggoose. I'm coming. They come back and check on me like, why ain't you? Come on now, you old man. Shout out to uh, Penny Pinching Prepper as well. I think he's, uh, whoa, there we go. I got caught on something. I think he's doing good on, uh, dang, no. That was a vine. I think he's doing well on his channel as well. He's putting out plenty of content for folks to watch. I pray his uh, channel has success. His and Shift Kickers both. Vines. Man, there are so many vines in the south, y'all. So 
Sometimes it's a good thing, sometimes it's a bad thing. If you're trying to walk with your pack on, it's a bad thing. You know, if you're getting berries or musket eyes or scuffing eyes or something like that, it might be a good thing. Just about up here to the campsite. I got one more turn to make. I may have to sit down and have me a drink of water. everywhere over here. You don't want to land on one of these stars. They'll show put a hole in. I've got some sorry. I've got some boo-boo stuff in my uh kit here on my pack in my pack. But uh nothing trauma related I don't think. Here we go. I see the firewood pile. I left it all up here. Whew. All right. There's the firewood pile. There's where I got my tent over in there, and I had the old wagon over there. So this is the campsite. Right here is where I had my fire. Y'all can see that. Had my fire right there. All right. I can almost set it down right here. I need a tree to lean up against or something. That way I won't even have to take my pack off. Because getting this pack on and off is a, is a bitch sometimes. I always get the uh, sternum strap twisted or something. It's in a pile of wires, but I'm going to do it. First of all, let me see if I can't get my water out. Don't look like it. Nope. Can't do it. I still have to take it off. Alright, let me uh, lean y'all up right here. Put y'all on the wood pile right there. Put that on the hole. Still recording? It looks like it. This thing will probably take me a, a day and a half to upload. <laughs> there we go. Well, it fell over. Sorry. That's what I can work out today. Maybe if I put my foot on it. This stick I've got the camera on is kind of crooked. Which means it ain't going to work too well. Be straight. Well, we we'll just have to be crooked for a minute, y'all. Uh, yeah. 
murky water. Excuse me. Oh, mercy. What a beautiful day. for a minute. I'll throw my pack back on and we'll uh, head the other way if we got memory card enough to do it. Shout out to Joe Morgan. I've been enjoying his uh, Eat My Short segments. <laughs> and shout out to uh, Yard Dog. I love that you're doing the Redneck Dictionary, brother. Uh, of course, I don't need those uh, instructions, but anybody else would. I've, I've enjoyed those as well. For the longest time, I didn't even know Yard Dog had a channel. If you have a channel, y'all, and we're in a live or something, let me know. I'll get the mods to post links. <clears throat> See if I can remember it. So quiet. Where'd the dogs run off to? Rocky! Ripper! They're probably in the creek, I would imagine, because it ain't far from here. Alright, we've had a little rest here. Let me, uh, let me get this pack back on. Sorry, y'all, I just have to lay over for a second. fall over, wouldn't you? You get back in there. There's them doggies. I got it on without twisting it. Yeehaw. Oh, come on, man. Starting to scrap, maybe it should be aight. Be aight. <coughs> Are we still recording? Yes, we are. All right. I'm headed back. I just can't move at no super fast pace with a bum leg. That's why I say I won't be the one on the battlefield. We'll have to have young men for something like that. If we ever have to do something like that. We'll have to have those young ones. I'm more the kind that's going to stick around where the cooking's being done. and If somebody finds us, I'll do what I got to do to protect the camp. That has to be more my role in the SHTF, more than likely. What is that? Belief again. That one was pink. Still going? Huh? Still going? Good deal. 
Maybe hey, it'll make it all the way back to the house. I don't know. This thing's probably going to take five days to upload. Come flying down through here. <laughs> 20, 30 mile an hour on four wheeler. I don't think nothing about it. Walking it's a little different. Vine, get off me. Starting to hurt now, almost fell. Another vine. Now I got one of my other ones. Get off me. Damn, man. That was close, almost fell. Ripper keeps coming back. Checking on me. <laughs> he could have done been to the house uh, 20 minutes ago. I see him go up the trail and he'll disappear and I'll see him come back and like, yep, there he is. Hey buddy. It's worth it though. I need the exercise. You just have to learn how to play with pain a little bit. Story of my life. <laughs> learn how to play with pain. up here to the intersection now. Selfie stick, that's literally a stick. Somebody going down the road in a loud ass vehicle. I see a little bitty piece of the moon still out, unless that's a cloud. It may be a cloud. A little bitty piece of the moon looks like.
another hole. Another hole. We're gonna heal. There you go. Need to talk good again to come down here and scrape in this roof. Take off all the high parts and put them in the low parts. Hey, buddy. Oh, ripper dog. This, you see all this dirt that I just showed you? This is all usually mud <laughs> in the winter time, but it's been so dry. And usually when it's muddy, I'll just avoid walking in it because I'll slip and fall, look like a complete dummy. Mud is treacherous. I go through it on the fall wheeler, no problem. As far as walking in it, nope. Not for me. Are we still recording? Yes, we are. All right. Well, my camera clean out must have did some good. Trying to avoid a hole, so I'm going over here next to the branch. Maybe it won't flat in the place. There you go. That one did this. Alright, swap hands. That's getting tired. The reason why I'm so concerned about twisting my ankle is I've got a rod drove down through it. I'm afraid if I twist my ankle, that rod's gonna come out and it's gonna be bad news. Surgery all over again. Oh, and speaking on that, <laughs> YouTube finally decided to push one of my videos. It just happened to be over two years old. So everybody thought I'd broke my leg again or whatever. I appreciate the thoughts and the prayers, but y'all, it happened two years ago. Thought I'd uh, bring that up while we're sitting here yakking. Because I had Nisi Tribe and some other ones. They were saying like, are you out of the hospital? And I'm like, what are you talking about? I ain't been in the hospital. And it's because YouTube decided to finally push one of my videos. It was an old one. I've noticed on the shorts, as long as you don't cover the topic of prepping, shorts will do real good. You'll get thousands of views. But if you make a short on prepping, nothing. Stupid algorithms, stupid YouTube, Google, whatever. Oh, there's a hole. Ooh, no, that's a rut. That's a big long rut right there. Stay my butt up out of that. A lot of these ruts are from uh, the idiot stepbrother. Uh, he comes down through here in the truck and gets it stuck. And then has to pull it out with tractors. And you're talking about just assing up a road. It really does ass up a roof. Alright. Are we still? Yep, we're still recording. Good. That's going to be a long ass video. Forgive me, Lord. I'm cussing.
just about back up here to the tractor now. That old tractor I showed you. Which means we're getting closer to the house. Oh yeah, she's a throbbing now, boys. Cards working. All right, boys. Well, right there is home. I'm that far away. So, y'all, I'm gonna go ahead and cut it. I hope y'all enjoyed the video. My leg didn't enjoy it too awful much. But, uh, we'll see y'all later. The doggies are running down to Dad's shop. <laughs> Bye, y'all. Be good. Prep up.